So by definition, menopause is the absence of periods for 12 months. There are many symptoms that go with menopause, and these can range from hot flashes, which occur in about 80%, mood swings, sleep disturbances, and vaginal dryness. So a hot flash can be described differently by different women. Some women describe a heat that starts in their chest and radiates outward. Other women describe the sen sensation that the heat is starting in their feet and rising through their body. We don't really understand what causes hot flashes. We do know that it has something to do with estrogen withdrawal because that's what's happening. The ovaries are no longer functioning and estrogen levels are starting to decline. Just like there's not one way that all women go through menopause, there's not one way to manage the symptoms. For some women, they can tolerate the symptoms such as the hot flashes by wearing layers, taking off sweaters and wearing a tank top and putting the sweater back on when they get cold. For other women, it becomes unbearable. They have up to 15 hot flashes a day. They can't sleep at night because of the hot flashes. And so they really want something. There is a whole range of treatments and there's not one right treatment for one every person. Um, the most effective treatment for menopause is replacing the estrogen. That's what we're lacking, and so by putting it back, you can effectively treat many, many of the symptoms. Other products which are over the counter, which have not been shown in scientific studies to actually be better than placebo, but anecdotally, I have seen them to help my patients, are things like black cohosh and soy products. Other women find that exercising and just living a healthy lifestyle, watching their diet, avoiding wine, um, can really help them manage a lot of the symptoms. And of course, it's really important to see your doctor every year to get your annual screening exam and to check in and see if there's anything else you need to be doing.